You're about to watch the very first video in this indie hacking series where I attempt to build a product from start to finish and hopefully make it successful. Now, I want you to do two things before we begin. First, subscribe, and second, if you watch the whole video, I wanna see what your opinions are about this idea that I have. Your input may actually really drastically change the outcome of the product. So about six weeks ago, my brother hit me up and asked me if I wanted to join a nine ball league with our cousin. Now I thought to myself, you know what, I suck. I'm not a good pool player, but you know what, F it. Let's have fun and let's play pool. Let's play nine ball. And if you're anything like me at all, then you become hyper fixated on your newfound interest. So of course, that means within the next few weeks, I bought an eight foot used pool table and I became very motivated to learn how to play properly. Now, being a YouTuber, I knew that there had to be a thriving community of pool playing influencers on YouTube. And of course there was. And what caught my eye was the fact that one of them was using some type of video projection system in order to help people learn how to play pool. And so I thought to myself, I've got to get a projector now. This is just way too cool for me not to try. As such, I began to research who sells these projection systems. Now remember, at this point, I'm not trying to compete. I'm not trying to make a product. I'm just trying to learn how to play pool. And I came across two competitors, ICA Training and Projection Pro Billiards. Now, each of these companies sell a Raspberry Pi, which is a very small computer. And as such, their software plus the hardware from ICA Training costs $895. And from the other Projection Pro Billiards competitor, they're $330 and that's not including the cost of a projector. And that's when the idea came to me. I thought to myself, wait a second, you have a computer near your pool table already. Most people have a laptop or a desktop PC. Uh, laptops are very cheap if you find on like Facebook Marketplace, if you don't have one. So why don't I just build software that will work on both Windows and Mac, sell just the software, and instead of selling it for something like $900 or $330, why not like 50 or $75? And that's when I knew I had something. I didn't go out and actively seek out an app idea to build in a niche that I had no personal interest in. This came about 100% by coincidence and it was a real problem that I faced. And chances are, if there's a problem that I faced, in this case, the expensive nature of these projection systems, then chances are other people are experiencing that same issue. So I purchased a used projector off of Facebook Marketplace for $300 and I mounted it clear up above my table so that it would cover it. And then I used Figma to create a prototype of a simple drill. Now I knew I had something here because being a beginner to pull, I was so quickly enthralled with attempting to solve this drill and pocket these three balls. Before I knew it, two hours had passed and I was having a blast playing with this drill and being able to spot these balls in the same location and alter the speed at which I hit the ball and where I hit the ball helped me tremendously in understanding how to play pool. Now I did purchase the Projection Pro Billiard System. I noticed that I could definitely improve on their UI and also include new features like internet connectivity. They also allow you to create your own drills, which is very cool and it would be a must in my app as well. Now at this point, I do have a developer and it's a developer I trust and somebody I've worked with in the past already and he's going to build this in Flutter. Now the name of the app is going to be AR Trainer for Augmented Reality Trainer by Racked. And Racked is the overall company name because believe it or not, I do have other product ideas. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below about whether or not you think this is a good idea, will it be successful? Do you think the market size is too small? For me to answer that question personally, I don't really care because this is a passion product and I know I will learn something just in and of myself and I'll get to try new things. So we have a lot more to do. Obviously this is just the beginning. In the next video, we're gonna tackle branding and identity design for this. 
After that, we also have the prototype that I'm gonna create in Figma that will show all the screens and the interactivity on the actual pool table. We also have to build the product, we have to test the product, we have to market and launch the product as well. So over the next few months, there's going to be quite a few videos added to this playlist. So please make sure to subscribe, support the channel, keep on checking out the, project, the progress of this particular project, and I'll see you very soon. Goodbye.